this is our thyristor control DC motor drive 2 HP with taco generator setup. This setup requires a controller and a DC motor 2 HP with mechanical loading arrangement and coupled with taco generator. Okay, and uh, in this we can study both armature feedback means uh, volt feedback and taco generator feedback there are two types of feedback here and provision for changing the speed of rotation forward and reverse and this is for changing the speed changing the taco generator input for forward and reverse direction uh, this is its potentiometer to set the speed of the DC motor and this is for on and off switches and uh, this is MCB and this input 230 volt supply point field supply point and uh, taco in point so you while connecting you don't interchange field with armature or armature with field or with taco all three connections should be proper so before uh, starting the experiment please check up field connection armature connection and taco in connection okay so this is single phase half controlled rectifier based DC drive and uh, there are three meters here one volt meter to measure armature voltage this this measure uh, armature current and this volt meter measuring rpm calibrated directly to measure rpm okay and uh, to start with the experiment initially you connect as it is uh, for this input supply field connection armature connection and taco in points the same we mentioned in the motor itself motor also armature field and taco this is taco output wire okay and uh, to start the experiment this uh, speed potentiometer is minimum this should be in taco position and forward and this should be in forward both should be in the same position is this also forward this is also forward and switch on the mcb so connect input supply from the 230 volt ac and this uh, field supply this indicator should be on and uh, once you start the experiment just press on okay and uh, set the rpm say 1000 rpm the motor starts rotating so to start with experiment uh, this uh, pulley should be loosened so set the rpm say 1000 rpm select echo generator feedback and uh, speed uh, that uh, direction rotation is forward and uh, this taco generator input switch should be also in forward okay now we set the rpm say 1000 rpm this indicates armature voltage this indicates no load current now now we can start uh, load initially it is no load current is 0.25 amps now we can load the current instead of Point now, in the armature, this is the taco field, remains same, but voltage, only small voltage will increase for uh, to maintain IR compensation. So they should be same only. This RPM should be maintained till uh, it is up to 5 amps we can load it till 5 amps it should be same speed it should maintain and voltage little bit small voltage maybe around 5 to 10 volts may vary increase okay now we can load up to 1.5 now it is so you can observe that speed same only and voltage small voltage going to increase now this is 2.5 and meantime you can measure the vf and vs set voltage is uh, now it is showing 6.88 now 
that is remain same now this is also almost same only 7.02 now we can load this voltage is uh, vf feedback voltage remains same only it should be showing negative only yeah it should be negative and you can load up to so speed same only for taco generator feedback now 5 ampere load to 5 ampere the voltage small voltage about 8 to 10 volts is increasing the speed remains same Five amps we have loaded. Okay, uh, this is for taco feedback for power direction, and uh, for uh, changing the reverse direction, you decrease the load minimum. Decrease the load to minimum. the minimum and switch off now again change the direction of rotation to reverse put the switch to reverse and uh, this switch should also be change it to reverse now we can press on now and set the speed to 1000 rpm now all meters are showing negative because now motor is running in reverse direction the same we can set the rpm to 1000 rpm now we can again repeat the same procedure for uh, reverse also by applying the load till 5 ampere So you can observe that it's showing negative or negative uh, thousand RPM, negative uh, sub voltage, and uh, negative current because of uh, is running in reverse direction. Up to five amps you can load. Okay. Now you can see speed remains same. voltage small voltage is increasing and current up to 5 ampere you can load now decrease the load to minimum potentiometer to minimum and switch off the controller and uh, now for uh, voltage feedback or uh, it's called voltage feedback or armature feedback so switch it to armature feedback now we start with power direction switch it to power power and now we can start switch on and the set the rpm say 1000 rpm this for armature feedback same 1000 rpm now what is the 153 current it is showing 0.74 amps in this also you can measure set voltage and feedback voltage between these two points using multimeter now we can see set voltage is 6.2 and uh, feedback voltage is 6.35 this voltage is almost 
सेम फॉर टोटल टोटल फॉर टोटल लोड नाउ टू स्टार्ट द एक्सपेरिमेंट इज लोडिंग लोड द मोटर टिल फाइव एम पी आर सो यू कैन ऑब्जर्व दट दिस आर्मेचर वोल्टेज रिमेन सेम ओनली हाउ दी स्पीड इज गोइंग टू ड्रॉप दट इज इज नथिंग बट ओपन लुक पैक सो इट इज गोइंग टू ड्रॉप नाउ यू कैन ऑब्जर्व एंड नाउ इट इज थ्री एम पी आर यू कैन गो अपू फाइव एम पी आर हाउ द स्पीड इज गोइंग टू ड्रॉप एंड वोल्टेज रिमेन सेम टू फाइव एम पी आर यू कैन लोड फ्रॉम थाउजेंड आर पी एम सो इट ड्रॉप टिल अराउंड नाइन हंड्रेड आर पी एम Okay, almost uh, 900 rpm. Okay, 900, 910 rpm. Now voltage remains same. Current up to 5 ampere. Now we can uh, decrease the load to minimum. So these readings you can note down for every 0.5 ampere of current speed. Voltage and current. You have to note it down. Okay. So bring it to minimum. Current. Now we switch off. Bring the speed to minimum. and switch off the drive now you change the direction of rotation to reverse and uh, this switch should also be changed to reverse or oh, this armature feedback only now we start the experiment and set the voltage to 1000 rpm this for armature feedback means what the voltage feedback and the motor open loop only Rpm, say thousand rpm. This is no load current. This voltage is one fifty eight volts. Now we can start load. For every point five amps, you can note down rpm, voltage, and current. So we can observe that the speed is going to drop now. Voltage remains same, and current up to 5 ampere. You can load. Okay. Now uh, decrease uh, the load to minimum. Decrease load to minimum. While motor is under running, don't change the direction of rotation. Please take care. Better uh, bring the Speed to minimum, and then change the direction of rotation. While uh, changing the direction of rotation, both switch should be changed, and uh, I'll take care while connecting. Field should be field only, armature should be armature only, taco end should be taco motor only, and also you can maintain the color code of the wires same: green, blue, red, blue, and red blue, red block. And input to connect to 30 volt supply. If available, better connect through auto transformer, single phase auto transformer of 10 ampere rating. Okay. And uh, one more thing, we have to take it down. In the back side, no, the back side, we have provided fuses for protection. Uh, this is for input to the supply to the fuse, and uh, this is output of armature uh, voltage supply voltage, and this for uh, field supply fuses we have provided. Okay, and uh, okay, and uh, this is about thyristor control DC motor drive. Thank you.